Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be running a quick tutorial on how to fully uninstall NVIDIA broadcast version 2.0 and revert back to an older update. This is for all my streamer friends, content friends, anyone who uses NVIDIA broadcast who has updated to 2.0. Um, I'm going to pop an image up here on the screen. If your NVIDIA broadcast looks like this, then you're totally fine and you can skip and you don't have to worry about anything. Um, but if yours is updated to 2.0, which we will get into in just a second, I'm going to be completely showing you how to uninstall it and just download the older version until there's a stable version of 2.0, um, which when there is a stable version, I will update the description. So, you know, 2.0 is safe to download, but for now it is completely unstable. It is bricking GPUs. It is causing extremely high load loads on the GPU and it's just an absolute nightmare. So let's just get right into it. So if your NVIDIA broadcast looks like this, um, this is the 2.0 interface. And while on the surface, it looks like it has some cool features and would be really cool to update to. Um, it just, again, like I said, just causes a lot of issues and PC sluggishness, and it's just not worth running right now when the older program still works perfectly fine and gets the job done for 99% of people. Um, and it's even breaking nine, 50 series cards so it's just not worth it at the moment so yeah so basically in the description there will be two links the first link is going to be to this website Revo uninstaller this is going to be the program we use to do a deep uninstall of all nvidia broadcast uh stuff because if you do it through the windows app uninstaller um it just doesn't remove all the files and this is the top this is the basically the top deep uninstaller um and then the other link will be just the um, the link that has the older version. Um, and when you click on the link, it'll auto start to download. Um, but we'll get into that. So once you get Revo uninstall or downloaded, um, I already have it installed. Um, so I'm just going to pull it up. It can be a little bit daunting. Uh, sometimes this will be pushed in. So you just have to pull it out. Um, it's going to have literally every application on your PC. You're going to go ahead and scroll down until you find NVIDIA broadcast 2.0, um, right click on it, uninstall. You can leave this checked. It really doesn't matter. Um, and just hit continue. Um, after the restart or after this is all going to be done, you're going to ultimately have to restart your PC um, before we start the install the new one. It's going to prompt up the NVIDIA installer. You're going to go through uninstall it through here as well because um, this will do the surface level uninstalling. Um, and then you're going to under scanning modes, you're going to scan um, and just leave it on moderate and scan, let it do its thing. Um, this is when it's going to be pulling those deep files that um, are hidden and that can conflict with the older version. Um, and so I will cut to when this is finished. All right, so now it is officially finished. Um, so essentially, we can um, just select all and um, just hit yes, hit next. It's going to get rid of all the leftover files that are um part of an issue you know anything that could cause an issue with when we go back to revert to the old version again here this is all the just nvidia broadcast stuff you're just going to go ahead and hit select all um and you're just going to delete them just to make sure everything is good um so that way you can have a fresh install when you go back to the old, older version. This is definitely going to take a minute. It's about six gigs of files. Um, all right, that is officially finished. Again, um, the files, the rest of the files will not be able to be fully deleted until the restart. And sometimes it freaks out a little bit. Again, these will be officially deleted as soon as you uh, restart your PC. So we just hit finish um, and it is officially uninstalled. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and restart my PC, and then we'll go ahead and um, start the install for um, the older version, and then you're good to go. All right, now that I've restarted and everything, uh, you can go ahead and download the link if you have not already. Uh, by just clicking on the link in the description, it should auto-pull you up to this page, which will auto-download the file. If for some reason it doesn't auto-download, then you can just click uh, this button here to auto like start downloading it. Um, and that older version will be downloaded. Um, and then you can just open it up. Um, which then you can just go ahead, go through, uh, just leave it on Express. Again, this will just install it as normally as you have in the past. Um, and... 
then as soon as it's done downloading, um, you'll be able to go back and set your microphones uh, to NVIDIA Broadcast again and use NVIDIA Broadcast as normal. Won't cause any um, issues, won't cause any GPU load, won't cause any issues in that regards. Um, and again, I will leave a comment in the description when it is okay to upgrade to 2.0. Um, I'll keep a close eye on it, but until it is stable and not gonna fry your GPU, I just would stay away from it. Um, sometimes when you open up NVIDIA, it will ask you if you wanna keep open or upgrade to the latest version, just keep hitting remind me later. It might be a little bit of a nuisance, but not as big of a nuisance as having to buy a new graphics card. Um, and yeah, so. I hope you found this a little bit helpful. I hope you were able to get it reverted. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments below and I will do my best to get those answered as soon as possible. So you can get your update reverted and everything else. Um, mine just finished um, and we are good to go. So I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you had a fantastic rest of your day. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if this helped you at all. And I will see you on the next one. Peace.